Foundation isn't your average pageant. It celebrates ladies of all ages and all backgrounds. Love this. The reigning Miss Heartshine is using her platform to share her story and inspire others. Sierra yes. Mack joins us now with what it means to have this title. Hi there. How are you doing? Hi, I'm doing so good. This is so exciting. Oh, good. <laughs> well, it's great to have you here because you were talking about um, the fact that you are actually from Paradise. Yes. Yes. And so, you know, with the fire that just completely swept that entire town away, it's amazing to hear the story about the young ladies who are Heartshine contestants who never stopped doing the, the um, community service that's so integral to what Heartshine is. Yeah, there was no break. In fact, I think we picked up more community service after. The fire. Wow. But I'm a Paradise High School senior graduate. This was actually my senior project in 2012. Oh, okay. wow. And it has now launched into a career. All that I want to do uh -huh. is run Heartshine because it stands for something really important. When the girls win their crowns and sashes, they know that it doesn't just sit on a shelf. They actually go out into the community and do community service. They can earn college scholarship based on the amount of volunteer service that they complete. Mm -hmm. And it's all about inner beauty. We are not a beauty pageant. We are called an inner beauty pageant because it's all about the light that shines from the inside out from your heart. When you give back through community service. Well, that's cool. Uh, yeah. that's, that's very cool to get Thank recognized you. for <laughs> inner beauty. I, I like this. Right. Yeah. So, what kinds of projects are these young ladies that we're taking a look at some video now? Uh, what kinds of projects are they doing? Uh, some things from local organizations to national charity organizations. Heartshine is known as a reliable, punctual, and positive volunteer force in the community. And I'm really excited to bring that to Sacramento. Sacramento yeah. has been really welcoming towards Heartshine and me personally. Mm -hmm. As a survivor of the campfire, we had an office in Paradise that we did lose. I also lost my home. We lost all of our belongings. Yeah. Relocated to Red Bluff, but now I just travel everywhere because Heartshine's actually launched. Uh, the positivity that we've gotten from the community and all of the support has been really beautiful. Mm -hmm. And I think we've gotten a lot of contestants here in Sacramento. They've heard about the Heartshine message. They know what it stands for, and they want to be a part of it. Awesome. And, and they can this next... Uh Event is happening here in Sacramento. It right? is at the Delta Queen, uh, Delta King in downtown Sacramento, a historic downtown Sacramento. Yeah. We're looking for uh, all different ages mm -hmm. coming to compete for that proper title that means a lot coming from the inside out. Mm -hmm. So po positive uh, energy, being really uh, upbeat and being confident on stage is important, but superficial considerations like traditional beauty standards are not a consideration into our judging and scoring criteria. So what do they compete in? What are the categories? Are, are there is different? an on-stage portion of competition where they answer a speech, an impromptu. They don't know what will be asked oh. because Heartshine girls are often asked to come into local news stations mm -hmm. and talk um, extemporaneously about their goals, their beliefs, their missions, and what they want to do for community service. There's also a formal wear competition, which is a fan favorite, but we're not looking for the most expensive gown. Mm -hmm. We are looking for the gown that brings out the personality of the contestant oh, that she feels the most beautiful in. Mm, okay, so you're actually still looking for contestants, is mm -hmm. that right? We've got a very limited number of spots still open. Okay, okay, okay. okay. all ages. And do we all get a crown like that? <laughs> that I, is would, so fabulous. I would love to have you compete for Miss Sacramento. We'll talk. We'll talk at the end of this. I love it. So if people wanted to get some more information, uh, they can go to your website. Uh, I've got it pulled up. It's mm -hmm. heartshine.net. Heartshine.net. We're also okay. on Facebook, Heartshine Events. Reach out to us, and there's a small application. Basically, you have to put into your own words what you want to do if you were to win a Miss Heartshine title mm -hmm. to give back to the community, because that's what we're that. all about. You will yeah. see these queens after they're crowned at different community service events throughout the year. That's fantastic. fantastic. Right. Thanks so much for Thank being here. Thank you so much. Now let's all wave goodbye to her. Right. Elbow, elbow, wrist, wrist. Oh, oh. Blow a tear, blow a kiss. I love the technique. <laughs> <laughs> blow a tear, blow a kiss. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> everything. Yes. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for being here. I really Congratulations to you and all that you've done. Absolutely. Thank you. After the fire, it's been really difficult, but it's also been really beautiful with you, the support. You are a roller coaster that's only going up, my yeah. friend.